cancel of bars that it may come to there will be showing you four bars lines four makosa bars lines you should know as a beginner okay these bars lines are simple okay so i'm going to be showing you how to play this makosa bars lines so get your bass let's get started so guys the key of this song is on c major okay I have my C here and I have my C here. Okay, so that's my C major scale. Progression is do, fa, so, fa, which is one, four, five, four, one. That's the progression, okay? So, guys, if you notice all my praise bass lines or lessons that I've been talking about, that I've been teaching you guys, you know, I've been saying this approaching praise is all about pattern, okay? You can do without pattern, and the fingering that I use in approaching the pattern, those two things, that is what you should look at for. Praise is not like worship, okay? Worship, you can pick your notes one after the other, okay? One after the other. Saying thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Mama. We are saying thank you, Jesus. You know, thank you, Mama. And that is worship for you. All you need for worship is those passing notes moving to the next chord progression you're going, moving to the next chord progression you're going. So for praise, you just have to put some notes together, you know, combining notes together to give you that some. Um, bass lines you want to hear or to create that bass lines you want to hear okay and to create that pattern so that's praise for you you can see there are two different ball games here so for this praise for this makosa praise bass line i'm going to show you everything i did there it's simple okay watch out for the pattern and for the fingerings that i made use of now the intro first okay the intro i played there was this So this is it. Don't forget the key again. C. So the intro there, what I did was do do re re mi mi la so re ti so re ti so fa la fa so do. That was it. That was the intro I did. Yeah. So let me take it again. One one two two three three. There's a kind of passing movement to my six. So la, which is my five six five. Then you go two seven five four six four five one. That was it. This intro is commonly used in our local churches. Okay, you and your band member. You and that was it now the first bass line i played here and the pattern is like um active so what i was doing is okay what i did on the one look at the pattern now Okay, a particular note you don't want to play, you're replacing it with another note. Okay, 
So the progression is one, four, five, one, four. So me doing that move, I'm meant to come down to four, right? But I replaced the four with the two. Okay, so that was it. Do, so, do, do, so, do. Re, la, re, re, la, re. So, re, so. D. 
string where you have your me so you're slurring to the me you're slurring to your three constant uh, note here that you're hitting with your tongue tom tom okay tom tom left tom and right tom it's still the same thing as but now you're ending on now let's trace that note that i'm hitting constantly that kind of off note that i'm touching there that would be my let's trace the key we are coming from Sixth note of the C major scale, that is what I'm hitting. That I'm hitting. Okay? So if you want to hear that deep note. So guys, hope you've learned something when you put these bass lines together. It helps your playing to be more fuller and also to be more groovy okay so this is a practice practice is the key word and if you're new to this channel please do not forget to hit that subscribe button before you leave you can afford to miss new videos i upload every day and turn the notification bell on so that you will be notified whenever i upload videos new videos okay and um, if you need private lessons from me also every information is in the description below send me an email or chat me by whatsapp indicating that you want to join the private zoom private lesson okay it's gonna be a live session between you and I okay so um that's all for today enjoy yourself see you in my next video bye